I want to talk to you first about your, your career. Um, you started at the anchor desk at WGME um, in the, I, I believe it was in the 70s. A little bit later than that, but... Uh, uh, like, just like I said, the late 90s. <laughs> <laughs> 1980, so you weren't far off. All right, that's, that's good. Um, so how much have things, did things progress over the course of time from when you started uh, to, to more recently? Oh my goodness, I mean in so many areas. I think for one thing I would say there are so many more women in broadcasting than when I started. And um, you know, I was really only the second female anchor of the 6 o'clock news at Channel 13. Wow. And um, the one before me had been there 10 years, so really not a lot of uh, women before me. And I also wondered when I started, how long can I have this career in front of a camera? There weren't a lot of women nationally even to look at. Your career was just um, incredible. Uh, you, you said that you, you weren't sure how long you would have that job, and then you ended up having that job um, and, and just, uh, pardon my French, but kicking ass at it um, <laughs> in every way possible. Um, and you also broke uh, new ground for other people, other journalists breaking into the field. Um, how, how important was that to you, or is that to you, to have had that sort of legacy in your career? Well, I mean, very important. Well, I started as an anchor slash reporter, and I stayed that way for the entire 38 years I was uh, working at Channel 13. I worked for 40 years at the company because I worked at the radio station before that. Yeah. But um, just so important for me to always help people understand that there was so much more to the job than sitting behind a desk reading news from a teleprompter. And um, I loved getting the big stories and the big interviews and um, just having the opportunity to make a difference in the community. And that's where I think journalism still plays such an important role.